Carlos Ramirez, owner of NVS Audio in Roselle, New Jersey. So, uh, we had a client with the Rockford drop-in saddlebag kit. Blew the woofers on the kit. So, he uh, it took Rockford a while to warranty the woofers because he didn't uh, they didn't have any in stock. So, um, I took it apart and did some research while we were waiting for the woofers to come in. And it turns out that Rockford, being the smart company that they are, didn't design a new woofer for these saddlebags. They took a woofer that had been tested and they knew worked well. They used their marine woofer. So the woofer that comes inside the Harley kit is the M1D210B. It is the same exact woofer that they use in marine. It just has these two posts screwed in the back to support it inside the saddlebag. And while we had it apart, we took some measurements to see what other woofers fit in the enclosure. But you have to realize that um, we recommend replacing it with the Rockford woofer. If you can't get your hands on the Rockford woofer, these are woofers that we physically tested that fit inside the enclosure, but we haven't tested the output, so we're not sure how they're gonna respond. They were not designed to work in these enclosures, so it might sound great, it might not sound so great, but um, obviously we use a DSP on every bike that we build, so I'm pretty sure we can tune whatever woofer to have acceptable output. But in case you're in a jam and can't find the Rockford woofer or Rockford doesn't have any replacement woofers, the Kicker CVT-10. So it's a 4.3 CVT-104. Drops in. So you won't have the rear support bolts, but the woofer drops in the enclosure, no modification. Uh, Kicker Comp RT also fits. So this is Kipper, Kicker Comp RT10. This is a 48CWRT104. Also, drop and fit. No modification. Uh, the Rockford P3 Thin. This is a P3 D410. This is their shallow mount P3. You have to sand a little bit off the edges, but it also drops in. So, for this bike, we're actually putting the Rockford Center Mountain new set of woofers, so we're using the correct woofers in this enclosure. Uh, for those that don't know the Rockford warranty policy, you have to cut the cone off the woofer. You have to cut the spider out because there is a sticker hidden in there. They need that sticker removed and shipped back to them with the warranty form. It is the only way they will warranty the speaker. It's uh, most companies just make you send a picture. Rockford actually makes you send the sticker in. So they do it to keep people honest uh, because there's some shady people out there that will say the speaker's bad and get a new replacement speaker and then just put the same good speaker back in. So being that you have to physically destroy the speaker, there's no chance you can reuse this speaker. But uh. Rockford has an excellent warranty program. They took care of this client. They shipped him out some new woofers. So he is back in business. I just wanted to show you in case you can't get the woofers or Rockford doesn't have the woofers and you want to get back on the road immediately. These are three other solutions. We have not tested how they sound yet. We will test it in the future, but it's just nice to know that you have options. Um, and that's it. We're going to get this loaded back up and get the client back on the road. So that was the Kicker CVT-10. That was a 4.3 CVT-104. That's a Kicker Comp VT-10. Kicker Comp RT. So that was a Kicker Comp RT-10. 4.8 CWRT-104.
or the Rockford P3 Thin. That is the P3 S D410. So this is the P3 Slim drops in there as well. We have not tested how these woofers sound in the enclosure. We just verified that they physically fit. So it's gonna take some trial and error, see if it's uh, worth the swap. And that's if you cannot get your hands on the correct replacement woofer, which is in their Marine series. You can buy the woofer by itself without the enclosure in case you blow one and you can't get one. Or so that would be the Rockford Fosgate M1D2-10B.